So I was thinking while I was blazing, while I was blazing, waiting for Weekly Weird to drop before I start drinking. Anyways, uh, yeah, I just watched a video on uh, Rich's channel, uh, Review Tech USC, and uh, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. some ordinary gamer got struck down for exposing uh, cash app scams. <laughs> and the other, <laughs> on top of the cash app scams, you know, those things are still up. But his video's down. <sighs> YouTube. <sighs> yeah, you literally sp screwed the pooch on this one. Um, maybe... You know, especially if you deny his appeal, like literally like that, like the Thanos snap. <laughs> that does not sit well with me, you know, like I'm, I'm sitting here at 38 subscribers. I'm a small channel, but uh, you know, like it just scares the shit out of me. You know, like if I uh, get a call from these scammers and I record it, do I get struck down? I'm fuck yeah, I may be fucking around with these idiots' livelihoods, you know, livelihoods, but, uh, some ordinary gamer did nothing wrong. Neither did Kit Boga, or even, uh, I think it's Jim Browning that I used to watch, too, when they would fuck around with these scammers. You know, like, you want to add apocalypse to happen? You know, like, okay, well, if you don't want to, that scene on your, your, uh, your platform, maybe they mass flagged it. The wrong people did. Ah, think of that there, YouTube. But, uh, whatever. I hope they, uh, you know, they, they usually, take, after enough backlash, they uh, tend to uh, reverse their decision, especially with a live person watching said video, even after the video's been down for how long. But uh, someone here gamer did nothing wrong. And I think you owe that dude an apology. You owe that dude an apology. Yeah. Uh, that was my, that's my take on it. I do not agree with it. I, if anything, uh, literally YouTube screwed the pooch. So, um, I'm done ranting. Have a good weekend, people.